In a world where the terrain is amplified, one man's survival journey continues. Let's play Survival Amplified with Daedalus822. Hey guys, this is episode 14 of my Amplified Survival series. What are we going to be doing today? Well, we're actually going to be starting to tick off a few things on the to-do list. Um, I've been meaning to put this corridor all over here into the mineshaft and pretty it all up because it looks so horrible and I've been lazy, so lazy, just been using this side area here. Well, got to fix that up. That's got to be fixed up. And if we have time, I want to go down to the mob farm and fix up the baby zombie problem down there. That's on the to-do list too. You know, and we're going to start preparing to go to the nether. I want to get mobs up here eventually. Got to do that. Got lots of things to do. Um, anyway, let's get started. So what we're going to do first, like I did a mining live stream the other night. Um, on the Amplified, and that went pretty well. Uh, got a lot of resources, which is fantastic. Whoop, grab this out. And, oh, if you if you don't already know, Datacraft is actually officially launched. I'll leave the link in the description for the texture pack, because this texture pack that I'm using right now is called Datacraft. And I will leave the link in the description for anyone to go download if, at, if they want to. Okay, we're going to grab some more, because I need to smelt some stone down to make some stone. Actually, we've got some stone brick right here. Yeah, I was going to say, we need more stone brick, but it looks like I might have some. Let's just smelt down a little bit more anyway. It's good to have backups, and we've got to start thinking about a storage room, because this place is just getting overwhelmed with chests everywhere. It's... Rah. Let's sleep in the bed. I don't know if we can sleep in the bed. Yeah. Go away! Go away, yes, I'm talking to you. Pain in the backside. Okay, where's this chest over here? So we got 40-something diamonds, which put our diamonds up, which is good. What the hell am I stockpiling gravel for? Sticks can come out. I got two slimes, that's good. Slime balls. Okay, we can throw some of that away. All right, okay, that can go. Gravel can definitely go. No, that can stay. Sticks can stay. Good stuff. All right. All right, the creeper's gone away from the bed now, so we possibly can be... Ah! you joking. Oh, whatever. Okay, it's going to be one of those... One of those episodes. It's just not going to be easy to get stuff done. Quickly go in here, open the door up. Uh, Okie dokie. So... Let me see. Okay, so we've got to bring the roof up because, look, it's, come on, it's squishy. We've got to bring the roof up and we've got to get rid of these chests, which are full of stone and dirt. You know, everything we dug out in the live stream for this hole here is pretty much in these chests. So, ooh, we've got plenty of oak wood planks, which is good. Some of these chests can just... Oh, man, that's right, I made heaps of chests. We can go, we'll, we will... Start transferring some of this junk. Go, 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 go. No one's chasing me any? Good. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll put some chests on the wall over here until we figure out where we're going to put a storage room. That's definitely on the to-do list as well. And... There we go. That will do for some storage right now. Throw all this in there. Now what we're going to do is just go break those chests. It's, it's easier to transfer items this way. A ton easier. Easier. Just so we don't get jumped. Oh, oh. Um, since Datacraft has been launched, people are starting to notice the, the door bug. See the, how the door is like opening on the wrong side? See the texture here? I want to point this out because I've been getting uh, so many messages. Uh, see how like the hinges are on this side and the door's meant to open from this side? It doesn't, as you've seen, it looks glitchy and bugged, and on from this side, it, it's all fine, right, until you open the door, which, you, yeah, Minecraft's actually doing that, and to prove my point, it's not Datacraft, the texture pack at all, I'm going to quickly switch to, well, not misses, to default to show you the problem, see, same thing, the hinges are on this side, the handle's on this side, but look, opens wrong side, it's Minecraft, and the and the bed the same. Oh, this looks horrible. So the bed is exactly the same. 
have a look at the bed on this side then you go on this side see the glitch bed it's warped the as this 1.72 it is glitched to all buggery just to tell you just just wanted to show you guys point that out it's not data craft it is actual minecraft itself default does it misses does it data craft does it <sighs> yeah i know bit of a pain in the backside but i just wanted to show you guys it is not data craft it is all texture packs right now hopefully they fix that soon because that that kind of annoys me actually now i've pointed it out people be like data i didn't notice before now i'm gonna bloody notice ah <laughs> i'm so sorry guys i didn't mean it i swear <laughs> it's like pointing a, pi uh, a face out on mrs texture packs pickaxe you know people don't notice there is actually a face on the on the on the pick right until you point it out and it's like Ah, oh, no, you didn't, sort of thing. You pointed it out, I didn't want to know. <laughs> sorry. If you didn't want to know, I'm sorry, but I just wanted to stamp that out right now. You know, it's a Minecraft problem. There's nothing I can do about it for Datacraft. It's, yeah. Because, yeah, since since Datacraft is now out, oh, wow, we're getting people with lots of bugs and reporting lots of things, which is a good thing, because that means I can fix them, but some things like, ah, I can't fix Mm. Don't you dare. Yeah, some things I cannot fix, like the door and the beds warped and yeah, that's Minecraft's problem. Yeah, it's it's disappointing I know, but nothing you can do about it. Okay. There we go. Got lots of spruce wood, eh? Whoa! Zombie villager zombie. Alright, the sun's coming up anyway. We shouldn't get disturbed anymore, which is good. Uh, get rid of this one. And then we can... I should make an axe. I should go get my axe. I've got an axe. I've got a... Not a diamond axe, but... Yeah, because it'll make it a lot quicker. But running back and forwards. Okay. Alright. I think I might pause the video real quick and get the rest of this done. You guys don't want to see me run back and forwards a million times do you? I hope not <laughs> and, and again sorry for pointing out that texture glitch bug problem I know it will annoy some, some people now because they, they haven't noticed it and now that they realize that Minecraft it's glitch it's warping the textures on every texture pack even default they'll be like ah oh, god damn it but I hope they fix it maybe the time this video is up uh, uh, our newer Minecraft's up and they fix the warp textures who knows who knows Okay, I'll be right back, guys. Alrighty then, I am back, and I've transferred all the stuff into the chests. I just had to kill a creeper, which is, that's why there's XP on the ground. Actually, I'm nearly level 30. I destroyed the door, I got, as I said, I just got rid of all the chests. That's all done. So now we need to create the hallway, and we need to plan out where we're going to stick everything. It's our next step. Let's just put some torches on the ground, because we'll be digging out the walls. So, I want this to be three wide, like this, and one up, but where am I going to take it? Alright, so what I'll do is put some slits in here, just to see where it's going to pop out in my base itself. Don't worry, you can fill it back in if it's no good. Yeah, that's fine. I think that's fine. That's perfect. So what we need to do, I'm going to, the whole, all my hallways are going to hopefully be three wide. Three wide just is a good number. It's nice and wide and th and three high. Three, three. There we go. Okay, that's a good number. So once we've done that, we can think about sealing this up. Don't worry, we'll seal up the outside with grass and, and proper stone. So, you know, you won't even notice that I've touched that sort of, uh, that, that landscape. So, okay, so that's connected nicely, but... As I was saying, I want to go one up, which is fine. So, makes it nice and tall. We're going to have to put some stairs in by the look of things. And we're going to go get some stone brick in a second, as soon as I've ripped up this top bit. Dig all this out. Alright. Okay, that's nice and tall. So, we will go get some stone brick. Yep. I need to put an industrial furnace in. I missed the one in my main series. <laughs> All 
right, just grab it all out. Make a. Don't even need to use a crafting table because you just put it in a, a four pattern like that. And looks like we're going to have plenty of stone brick for this. Bam. Okay, that's good. Um, we'll seal this up for now so we don't get nasties jumping in on us. And we want to do these sta stairs here. Yep. Okay, so I want the stairs to come in a little bit. Uh, should that do? No, a little bit further, I think. Let's see. That will do. Dig out the floor as well. Actually, where do we put that... The flooring. Let's put the flooring in right away. Right over here. Uh, that's the dark stuff. Where's the light stuff? I thought I had light stuff. I only have dark stuff. That's. Oh no. Okay. Not much light stuff. Oak wood. That's a shame. Doesn't matter. Should be a plenty for what we're doing though. So in here, we'll dig this all out here, yeah, so now we don't have to use the outside entrance, we're going to be putting the door over there to get outside, just we'll run this right to the mine shaft elevator, Let's see how much wood we got, we need to make some stairs too, oh, we got to be careful of the darkness, get some nasties to spawn and we don't need that. I guess I brought it like that. Okay. And then stone brick that up like that. Okay. Torches first, Dad. Torches first. I'm not going to... I'm not filling this in yet because of, um... You know, we're going to fix the walls up. Uh, stairs. That's what we need to make. Just a couple. Don't even need too many. Um... Well, okay. There we go. 40 is perfect. And we put these in here, and here. How does that look? That's not looking too bad. It's part of the structure. It's good. So now we need to go fix up the mine shaft before we continue. Um, now I did say originally I was going to make this whole room round. Not a problem. We just do this. Make sure there's plenty of light inside the wall because, you know, you hate when you build something and then a mob spawns inside the wall. So you can either fill it up with cobblestone like this. Or just light it up, you know, it doesn't really matter. But we're just, we see we're following the, the, the same outline as the the actual mine shaft itself. Actually, I'm just going to fill it in. I'm worried about, bleh, in the wall. They want to eat my brains. And we need to put some more torches up since we're knocking them all out. Like that. Yeah. All right, we can see. Fix the wall up over here just to kill. So, pe you know, people's OCD might be like, Daddy, you did all wall except that one corner. So, I'll do it. fix this up. So, I've been shooting YouTube videos for so long now, I'm starting to adapt to, yeah, <laughs> see what people like. Okay, so, see, now the whole room matches, which is fantastic. Now, what we're going to quickly do is just run some light around the room, like so doesn't have to be neat for now because eventually I want to put glowstone in here roof that is right we need to change this roof it three high is a nice you can even go four high but I think I'm gonna just three is perfect for me okay so while I'm doing this let's talk about how we're going to get some animals up here obviously we can't use the the, the elevator unless you're gonna hang them on the way up I was thinking of just creating a cobblestone staircase down to the mainland and then ripping it back up when we got the we got the animal whatever the animal is up here chickens we could just go to remember the previous episodes where we got the chicken from all those chickens were and they're laying eggs we could just go fence them off and wait for a bunch of eggs and you know bring them back and hope for some hatches that's what we could do for the chickens but you know i want cows and i want pigs up here sheep too would be nice a couple of sheep to breed and get those colors working all right yeah no that would be good i just i don't know if you got any suggestions yeah I'll post them in the comments like normal and i'll yeah i'm just not sure how i'm gonna get them up i'm just probably gonna just do what i said cobblestone staircase 
we'll get a lead, lead them up here. We gotta find a slime chunk and try build a miniature slime farm would be fantastic. Because I want piston doors, I want sticky piston doors. That is definitely on the high to-do list, I want that. Okay, see there we go, nice high wall now, it's not so squishy. Is that the word? Squishy. What is... Uh, I can't think of the word, but, you know, those people that are scared of small spaces. What is that called again? It's slipping my mind right now. Ah, I hate that. I hate that when that happens. Someone will point it out in the freaking comments. They always do. So I hope you guys are enjoying Datacraft, because it did take me an entire year to uh, get to this stage. It's nowhere near done. There is so much to do with Datacraft. It is not even funny. And the amount of messages I'm getting about Datacraft running, oh, you haven't done this, you haven't done that. You, you, oh, seriously? It's like, hello, I actually know what I have and haven't done. It's just, you guys are just reporting glitches. That's all you should be doing, and you should uh, be reporting it on the Datacraft homepage. Uh, you don't need to send me a message. Just go create a new thread and go, hey, Data, I found a glitch with the the hopper. It's uh, dub, something random. It is like a giant vacuum cleaner. It is sucking everything up, and I can't stop it. It's, yeah, <laughs> you go to glitch. Oh, but yeah, yeah. Just thought I'd mention that. You don't have to message me. Go create a post. I'll get to it eventually. And you should look at the list that's already there. Mr. Red Dragon, which is moderating the Datacraft homepage, he's uh, created a nice little list already that of people have reported bugs. And, um, yeah. That's why I had to mention the door bug at the beginning of this this episode. Just to stop all those hundreds and hundreds of messages. Oh, wow. It was crazy. Alright, so I'm just going to go with a stone floor. Ah, uh, floor. You, you fruit loop data. Stone roof. Stone roof. Yeah. Nothing fancy. But, yeah. Um... I, I guess I'll be right back and we'll continue. You guys try skip a little bit of this boring stuff, but work is work. Got to get it done. Alrighty then. I am back and she is done. Roof's in, floor's in, looking lovely. We can actually put the torches back every second block apart. Would be nice. So there, 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 and there. So with this side, oh, is it wobbly? Nope, it's not wobbly. This side. Um, okay. Yep, there. Awesome. We can get rid of those. Hopefully, when we get some glowstone, we can stop using torches and start using carpets. This carpet would be nice. We've got to carpet all this. But there we go. Lovely. Lovely. That's perfect. That's what I wanted to be, get done. Oh, yes. That's way better now. Good stuff. Ooh, it's night time. Let's see if we can sleep again. <laughs> nope. Yeah. Ah. Damn nasties. Uh, okay, so what we're going to do is grab some dirt, which we should have plenty of dirt. We'll go fix out the outside. Um, dirt? Hello? Where are you? There's some dirt. Oh, there's plenty of dirt. I was thinking to myself, what the hell? Okay. Oh, and of course it's just bucketing down with rain. Holy smokes. This may get nasty. Holy smokes. I changed my mind. I want to go back inside. Go away. Alright. So everything's going to be okay. Alright. Mine this up just so we don't... I want to make it look natural. So dirt, dirt. That's all fixed up. We can get rid of the torches now. Get rid of the cobblestone. Dirt all this up. Dirt this up. Fix all this up. There we go. Ha ha, what's wrong? You can't get... Oh. Get off of the mountain. Bye! <laughs> okay. We can dirt that up. That's right. A creeper detonated here and destroyed a huge bunch. As long as we put dirt over it, the grass will eventually spread. Making this whole area look natural again. Like that. Fill in the corner a bit. There we go. 
Good stuff. Is it sun coming out? What's going on? Whip! I missed a piece of glass. That's going to bother me. There we go. It doesn't even look like we've been here. So, fantastic. Good stuff. The Once the grass grows over everything, it'll be fine. Right as rain. Put some stone bricks back there. Boom! I should fix that up now. Boom. There. Dark spot there. A dark spot here. There we go. Alright, let's put those door... Oh, yes. Ha-ha! Stop the rain and get the sun out at the same time. Okay, some do new doors. Let's put some of this dirt away now. Let's get these doors in. These broken texture doors that I wish Minecraft would hurry up and fix. I can hear them burning outside. <laughs> okay, quickly get these doors. Should we do metal doors? Or we'll just, yeah, let's do some metal doors. Got plenty of iron. We can do that. I was going to do wooden ones. Let's just do some metal ones instead. Okay, we only need two. One. Two. What if the texture on the metal doors is broken for all the texture packs as well? Not sure. Uh, we need a gap, so here. Oh, that's not cool. Boom. And boom. Cute stuff. Okay, we need a... What do we need? Do we have any stone left? Of course I don't. Uh, let's go through some stone in the in the smelter. There we go. All right, let's create some some no uh, lever will do probably just fine for now. Do I put in a some cobblestone? Um, lever. There we go. A couple of those bad boys. Just so we can open the doors for now, and we can just leave them open. Yeah, I think the textures on this doors are fine. Okay. Fix this up. Eventually, when we get some more slime balls, we can start thinking about using a building, like, sticky piston door with a lock and everything else. Gotta do that. That's definitely gonna be done. All right. Carve some of this down a little bit, just to make it look a little bit more nicer. There we go. Once the grass grows here, perfect. Torch, torch. Perfect. Good stuff. Good stuff. Wow. I need to harvest all that. But there we go. So the grass should be growing. Wow, I need to chop the rest of these trees down. I get lazy sometimes, I know. But there you go, that's another job that bites the dust. Yep. Grass is growing, you don't even know I've been up there. There's no cobblestone left. Fantastic. So I'm actually thinking about putting the portal room to get to the nether on top of this. Building a second level eventually. Having a portal room up the top. That will be pretty cool. Yeah, we've got to think where we're going to put this... Um, we can lock these so no nasty zombies want to come in and do nasty things to us. <laughs> uh, there we go. Good stuff. All right. How much time? Oh, we're definitely out of time. Wow. I've been talking way too much. All right, guys. Thanks for watching episode 14. Are we up to 14? Yep, we're up to 14. Thanks for watching episode 14. Join me for episode 15. I think next episode we're going to start tackling... Fix that mob spawner. Well, not mobs. The, the XP farm's got to be fixed up a little tad. Uh, what the hell is that dirt block doing there? That's driving me up the bloomin' wall. I'm going to have to get rid of that. Um, and we're going to make a cobblestone staircase. Maybe make a lead and try get some animals up here. That's, yeah. Alright, we're going to definitely do that in the next episode. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. And I'll catch you all later. Click to the left to watch the previous episode, or to the right to watch the next episode if it's available. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to join the conversation at www.daedalus822.net.